All right, I'm going to do a talk on this. This is the uh, mine, mine calendar, and Mike is here beating on me. Um, and w I just discovered this, this image on Christmas. Um, and you could say Christmas, I would say, is kind of a, was, a, was, a, was an amazing day for me, for my family. They all went off. I had the day to myself, and I was able to meditate, did a video that I'm uploading now, some confessions that I'll share with you. But whilst I was doing that talk in front of the Butsudan, um, I was talking about my circle on my, f I have, a, I have a, a, a circle on my face, right, which I thought was stress. And I thought, you know, I know something, you know, with this Mayan ca calendar, it's, there's a lot of, um, I don't know, juju, whatever. There's a lot of uh, distributive unconsciousness thinking about this event, right, globally. And I've been thinking about it, but I, you know, I just was kind of with coincidence, but I thought, you know, I wonder if there's anything online with the mine and, um, you know, in a circle. So I did, I did, um, I said Mayan circle, right? Um, and then immediately the first thing that I saw was this image. Now, what struck me as interesting in this image is one is a circle is important, is very important to me because with, from my, how I define enlightenment, like enlightenment is existing in the circle, right? It's in the middle. Everyone runs around the circle from highs and lows, right? But everyone is enlightened. Enlightenment is there. See, they're inside the circle. You notice the circle is inside. So, um, and the other thing that I that I just actually noticed now, really thinking about it, when I when I saw it for the first time, was I was like, gosh, you know, that really looks like a computer or or a, or a laptop, you know, <laughs> you know, on his back. There's a face there. There's a monitor. It looks like a monitor, right? And I was sitting here looking, and I was like, you know, I spend all my time cross-legged on the floor. I don't know if you know, but I live in Japan, and I don't have a table or anything else. I'm cross-legged. And um, <clears throat> actually, um, I'm trying to think of the way I sit. Um, you know, and the, the fact is, is, is the way, you know, if you think of this image, he's working, right? He's bent over. He's working on this. But how does someone work sitting down, right? That's very odd. Don't you find it? So, obviously, the ground, they're making a point that there is the floor by uh, putting the, you know, the the rocks, right? Uh, the wall, you know, it's, it's and I do. I mean, it's, it's construction. And, um, and then leaning over and... Um, you know, and obviously he's he's working on something. He's 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 you know, and that you could say that's you know toiling on this thing, and it's wrapped around his head the way that they have it, you know, together. So he's working on this thing, and if you look at it, it looks kind of like a computer. There's the monitor, there's the face, and see, the key thing um, that we have that's embedded, that's part of. Our solution is a multimedia solution, right? It's images. It's a face. And this could be keyboards, you know, little strikes here. So this image to me is, 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 is very profound and it's meaningful to me. And, you know, and I feel like, you know, this is me. And I don't know if that sounds really crazy to other people, but I feel like it, it's, you know, my role that what I'm doing is, is really important. Um, to bring this about, to bring OIF, the Open Incubator Framework, a framework that will allow anyone in the world to launch an idea without the need of these guys. These are the guys that in the past, these are the 1%, I think, you know, or maybe this, I don't know, you know, this is how I look at this. Um, so what do you think? Am I completely mad, right? I sit on the floor, cross-legged. Here it is, Turing. He's working on this thing. He's got his arms, his he, his hands up there like he's typing. But you've got to remember, they didn't know this paradigm. They would have dressed me. They would have looked. You know, they wouldn't. They would know. You know, the artist would have rendered me like one of them. And working would have been carrying. Right? That's would have been working. The idea of sitting at a table and working it would have just wouldn't have made any sense to them. So, um, I'm trying to think what this belt is here. Just I think that symbolizes work, because I don't. Or you know what? That could be. I know what that is. That is the wires coming out of it. That they made it into a belt. What do you think?